Guys, a very good morning to all of you. I am Sabah, your English faculty at Allport. Good morning, everyone, and I welcome you all on our official YouTube channel. So, I hope that I, uh, I hope that I am audible and visible to you all. Just need your quick confirmation. So, yes, I think everything is fine. We can start this session. Okay. So guys, today also we have two different articles of two different genres. Both the articles are very, very important, okay? But besides, we are going to get so many good vocabs, items, and phrasal verbs, okay? So today's session is going to be very enriching. So I request you all to quickly join in the session and share this session with others. So you can share join the session one time, okay? So let's start this session. Many idioms, many phrasal verbs, everything we are going to have today, okay? So if I talk about yesterday's homework, it was done by Tina, Shafi, Nafish, Divya, Arju, Sona, Apoorv, Rekha, Ilakya, Dhirendra, Renu, Anand, Sanjeev, Vishal Gupta, Geeta Singh, Rajesh Das. All these people did the homework, okay? Today's quote is, your positive action combined with positive thinking results in success. See, for success, do not inculcate Ill, Ill thoughts or ill feelings inside you. It is not necessary that if you want to achieve success, so you have to harm others, okay? So have positive, have positive thinking, work positively, definitely all these things will give you success, okay? And guys, even if you achieve success by harming others or by uh, letting someone down, so so that success definitely it will not give you happiness okay so keep this thing in mind that success with positivity is definitely important now guys quickly like this session share this session with others and subscribe to our vital channel fata fata se ek baar sabhi log session ko like kar dijiye share kar dijiye channel ko subscribe kar dijiye if you are here for the first time okay now glimpse of the session so as usual we will start with the revision session we have one slide only for revision but we have many vocabs today okay you will get good vocabs more than vocabs today the idioms and phrases and phrasal verbs these two things are going to be very important today because many idioms and phrases many phrasal verbs we are going to get okay then we are going to discuss both the articles no politics based article so okay so after many days we are going to get two different articles of two different genres okay then grammar learning also we have tone objective we have practice exercise that is the homework okay so i hope by this time your hi hello everything is done you all are settled for our revision session shall we start so i want to see the competition in this revision session okay so i hope everybody is settled giving you 5 more seconds so get settled on quickly guys so that we can start this session okay hmm chale quickly <laughs> Why you guys are taking time? As is what are you? There is no confusion. All simple words I have given you. So why you guys are taking time? So let's quickly see the answer. Simulate basically we call to feign. Feign, pretend, imitate. All these are the synonyms. Okay. Feign basically means pretend, imitate. All these are the synonyms of the word simulate. So A will be matched with third. Intractable, intractable basically we call to obstinate. A person who doesn't want to change or something that you cannot change. Okay, so that's called intractable. So obstinate, stubborn, all these can be the synonyms. Okay, so B will be matched with six. Behemoth basically we call to colossal, giant, gigantic. Okay, so that is called behemoth. C will be matched with first. Flux means continuous change. Rapid change, continuous change. That is called flux. D will be matched with fifth. Myriad means countless, infinite, numerous, countless, infinite. So, it's a lot number, mein hota hai, so that is called myriad, okay? Propriety means decorum, decency, norm, your particular way of doing something, okay? So, that is called propriety. F will be matched with fourth. 
एडवांस एंड फर्दर दे आर सेनन इज फर्दर हियर मीन्स टू प्रोमोट समथिंग सो एडवांस बेसिकली वी से टू प्रोमोट और फर्दर समथिंग ओके सो इट विल बी मैच विथ टू यस फॉर जॉन्ट वी हैव द वर्ड कैर कैन टू एन ऑल्सो ओके सो यस यू कैन से ओके only by focusing and taking 2 minutes time to read the question that is the only way to overcome got it guys chaliye it was all about your revision session 3615742 that these are the idioms uh, sorry uh, this is the correct pair okay now let us start today's session so the first word of today's session is linchpin so linchpin basically we call to a person or thing vital to an organization vital means very very important so something that is very important for an organization that is called linchpin can we call it backbone so simply the backbone of any organization theek hai so that is called linchpin next word we have is envisage again linchpin is noun envisage is a verb envisage means foretell forebode predict okay so foretell forebode predict you know theek hai ki kya kehte hai isko herald so many words we have okay so it means to think about future augur so many words we have for this every day we get this word also in visage okay yes presage augur so many words we have ठीक है तो सिंपल सा मतलब होता है कि फ्यूचर के बाद फ्यूचर को आंखना ओके सो दैट इज कॉल्ड एनविसाज नॉ नेक्स्ट वर्ड वी हैव इज मॉरिबंड नॉ दिस इज अ वेरी गुड वर्ड मॉरिबंड यस एंटिसिपेट आल्सो यू कैन से तो एंटिसिपेट एक्सपेक्ट ऑल दिस कैन बी द सिनेम्स ओके मॉरिबंड मीन समवन सी मॉरिबंड बेसिकली वी कॉल टू अ पर्सन हु इज ऑन डेथ वेड सो इफ अ पर्सन इज ऑन द वर्ज ऑफ डाइंग on the verge of dying means he is very weak okay he now there is no life in him okay so that is called moribund so it means waning declining or dying so any industry anything that is declining that is dying that is called moribund okay next status quo status quo basically we call to existing state of affairs so jo cheez abhi current mein chal rahi hai that is your status quo okay next word we have is catalyze so moribund can is a noun okay it can be an adjective also and catalyze is a verb catalyze means cause or accelerate catalyst aapko pata hai catalyst kya karta hai kisi bhi cheez ko expedite kar deta hai so to accelerate something to expedite something that is called catalyze to speed up something kisi bhi cheez ke process ko badha dena that is called catalyze now next word we have is untenable these words are very important guys intractable untenable to ye sab milte julte jo words hote hain they are very important untenable means that cannot be defended or supported it means that can't be defended or supported matlab that is false matlab bilkul aapko pata hai ki galat baat hai to isko pe koi support ho hi nahi sakta us cheez ko aap kabhi support kar hi nahi sakte so that is called untenable okay so insupportable unarguable something that cannot be defended or supported that is called untenable okay got all the words guys now these are the vocabs related to first article yahan tak ke words aapko first article se related hai now we are going to start vocabs of second article okay So the first word of second article is inevitable. So inevitable, so many times we have seen this word, something that is certain, that cannot be avoided, that will happen. जो निश्चित है, जो हो के रहेगा, ठीक है. So that is sure, certain, that is called inevitable. Next is heist, money heist. आप सबने सीरीज देखी होगी. So heist basically we call to steal or robbery. Okay. So money heist you might have watched, you might have seen that series. So impeccable is different, Prabhat. Impeccable we call to flawless. Impeccable means flawless, without any mistake, without any flaw. That is called impeccable. Heist basically we call to, uh, sorry, inevitable means sure or certain. Okay. Heist we call to steal or robbery. Okay. Next, thumping. Thumping means of an impressive size, extremely very. Thumping victory, we can say. ठीक है? So thumping victory means an impressive victory, extremely very. That is called thumping. What do you mean by this word? Pull off, Mr. Innocent. Next word we have is imbibe. So imbibe is a verb. Thumping can be an adjective. It can be a verb. 
हाँ थम्पिंग मेचोरिटी थम्पिंग विक्ट्री ठीक है सो इम्पाइट बी से एब्सॉर्ब टेक इन एक्वायर ग्रास मतलब किसी भी चीज को इनकलकेट कर लेना टू इनकलकेट समथिंग दैट इज कॉल इम्बाइप ओके सो यू आर ग्रासपिंग समथिंग यू आर एक्वायरिंग समथिंग यू आर टेकिंग इन ओके सो दैट इज कॉल इम्बाइप लर्न समथिंग द नेक्स्ट वर्ड वी हैव इज रीगल रीगल इज एन एडजेक्टिव रीगल मीन्स majestic or grand okay so regal means majestic grand impressive all these are the synonyms next word we have is culmination so culmination we call to finale climax pinnacle matlab kisi bhi cheez dekhiye pinnacle means height also pinnacle you know the top most point also but culmination we also call to finale okay so the last part of something the last match of something that is called culmination ठीक है यस रीगल यू कैन रिलेट इट विथ ऑगस्ट ऑल्सो सो ऑगस्ट ऑल्सो वी कॉल टू ऑनरेबल ओके ऑगस्ट ऑल्सो मीन्स ऑनरेबल इंप्रेसिव ओके ऑल थी सब ओके चले नेक्स्ट हा मुन्ना देर इज एन आर्टिकल अबाउट आईपीएल ओनली सो दीज आर दर्ड्स रिलेटेड टू आईपीएल आर्टिकल ओनली चले नेक्स्ट वर्ड we have is innate innate basically we call to inborn or natural something that is naturally present in you okay so you don't have to acquire that that is called your innate talent we say so inborn talent natural talent that is called innate okay so innate is again an adjective next word we have is falter so falter basically we say hesitate delay it means lose momentum or strength so when you lose strength or momentum that is called falter okay Hmm. The next word we have is playoffs. So playoffs we call to an additional match played to decide the result of a contest. So क्या IPL में additional match खेला गया था finale में? So playoff basically we call to an additional match played to decide the result of a contest. That is called playoff. Okay? अब ये तो आप ही लोग बता सकते हैं, ठीक है? Next dugout. Dug out basically we call to a low shelter at the side of a sports field or teams for teams coaches. So team के coaches के लिए या जो associates होते हैं team के उनके लिए एक जो side में shelter बनाया जाता है that is called dug out. Okay? So dug out basically we call to a low shelter at the side of a sports field for teams coaches. Okay? अच्छा it is a part of a format. अच्छा thank you, thank you for telling me. नेक्स्ट वर्ड वी हैव इज फिजर फिजर बेसिकली डू वी नीड टू डिस्कस दिस आर्टिकल मुझे तो लगता है आप लोगों को बहुत ज्यादा पहले से ही पता होगा सो फिजर इज अ नाउन फिजर बेसिकली वी कॉल टू डिस एग्रीमेंट ओके सो सॉरी इट इज अ नाउन so yes disagreement failure all these can be the synonym okay gap all these other synonym for crack gap all these other synonyms for the word fissure okay so yes descent here yes, so many words dug out is also a noun okay next idioms and phrases okay idioms and phrases so the first idiom is on the anvil very good idiom we have on the anvil we call to something that is in a state of discussion or preparation matlab something that has not been finalized abhi wo chal hi raha hai pura nahi hua hai so if that is underway underway also we say na uh, that is uh, in progress okay so in a state of discussion or preparation something that is underway in progress that is called on the anvil okay next word we have is come in handy come in handy means something that turns out to be useful okay these vocabs will come in handy during your examination so of course this entire editorial session will come in handy in your examination it means it will turn out to be useful in your examination okay so that is called come in handy so something that uh, that turns out to be useful the next word we have is atem atem means in charge of something the dhoni is atem of this uh, csk you can say okay so atem means in charge of something next word is second wind this idiom we have discussed also in 9 am session ki exam mein pucha gaya tha to second wind basically we call to revival of your energy so a new strength or energy to continue something so when you uh, when you revive yourself when you charge yourself okay so that is called second wind a new strength or energy to continue something okay 
and the last idiom is settle the dust so settle the dust means allow situation to be calm or normal so when you are allowing some situation to be calm or normal so that is called settling the dust clear everyone got it so these many idioms we have got and these idioms are related to both the articles okay dono hi articles are related hai now next word we have is phrasal verbs okay we have many phrasal verbs also the first phrasal verb is rope in rope in we saw earlier also rope in means force or persuade someone to join a group to jab aap kisi ki ki bhi person ko force karte ya persuade karte kisi bhi group ko join karne ke liye okay so that is called rope in okay next word we have is spill over so spill over means a thing that spreads into another area matlab bah jana dusre area tak chale jana theek hai next day tak continue hona pull off pull off means achieve or fulfill okay so pull off basically we call to achieve or fulfill prize out prize out means drag out prize out has one more meaning that is force someone to reveal a secret okay so for someone to reveal a secret uh, prize out we also call to drag out okay so guys as you know we have multiple courses on olivewood platform now those who are interested in joining olivewood platform this is the right time because we are having flat 45% off uh, 40% off on banking subscriptions and 45% off on ssc subscriptions okay so you can join banking super elite ssc super elite uh, because now your examinations are also around the corner bahut jaldi ab aapke examinations hone wale hain so now there is no time to sit and relax be prepared gear up yourself for the preparation for your examination if you really want to take the selection okay so join all these courses so we are starting practice batch also for cjn you can join that batch so we have started multiple courses on olivewood platform you can join that batch so if you have the access of uh, banking or ssc super elite ka agar aapke paas access hota hai so you will be able to join the new modular course that i am going to launch soon on olivewood banking platform for banking aspirants okay so for purchasing anything on olivewood platform use my code sabha for additional discount join this telegram channel for updates and for pdf har session ke update ke liye pdf ke liye you may definitely join this telegram channel okay i know we world cup hai na chaliye guys quickly read this article nice article it is quick reading there are many repeated items in kapoor so no need to do all so this is also a very nice article uh, guys quickly read it nice article also and useful article also no actually this article is on insurance policy okay so irda okay that is insurance regulatory and development authority of india okay irda is now coming up with such a policy that can cover every citizen of india and it is affordable for every citizen of india okay so we uh, it is planning to launch such an uh, insurance policy okay so the irda of india's plans to expand risk protection levels need government backing now its plan of uh, expanding risk protection iida wants that this health benefit risk protection it should be uh, availed by every citizen of india okay so now this planning needs government backing backing in support ki without government support iida will not be able to uh, execute its plans right wo apne plan ko fulfill nahi kar payega execute nahi kar payega okay last week the chief of india's uh, insurance sector regulator unveiled a fresh blueprint unhone ek naya blueprint unveil can unveil means uh, he disclosed unveil means disclosed okay 
to cover a larger portion of the population against the risk of adverse shocks with an eye on ensuring everyone by 2047. So, he, uh, IRDA has this target, okay, that by 2047, it plans to ensure every population of India. At least they should have health insurance, risk insurance, okay. Ki koi bhi agar risk hota hai, to at least they might get some financial help that time, okay. So, that is the plan of RDA and definitely it is a very nice plan, okay. The linchpin of this UPI like moment. So it will it is going to be the same like UPI. Like UPI now everybody is using UPI, right? Being pursued by the Insurance Regulatory and Development Authority of India to bridge the country's huge protection gaps is envisaged to be a simple all-in-one insurance policy. Okay. Now what is the backbone? The most important part of this moment that is going to be like UPI. UPI has turned out to be very successful India for India. Okay. So it, it is being pursued by IRDA to bridge. To bridge means to fulfill the gap. Okay. The country's huge protection gap. So there is too much gap. Still poor people they do not have any insurance. They do not have any risk protection. So I just IRDA just wants to bridge that gap, okay? And it expects it to be a simple all-in-one insurance policy. So simple language, it is going to be all-in-one insurance policy, okay? This bundled Bima Vistar, bundled Bima Vistar means this policy will come up with so many uh, you can say benefits. Is my coffee sari benefits okay? That is why it was it is named that is Bima Vistar. Okay, scheme being worked out with life and general insurance. Okay, so uh, life and just say LIC okay, as insurance and it will work out with them. Would provide households with expeditious monetary support and not only providing the risk insurance. Actually, IRDA wants that in times of crisis, they should be given the uh, payment okay that money within 24 hours so this is going to be very expeditious very fast monetary support okay so it wants that every household should be given fast monetary support in case of medical emergencies unko bahut zyada claim karne ke piche bhagna na pade okay so whenever there is a medical emergency accident theft or a death in the family so in all these cases irda wants to provide a fast service fast monetary support okay with awareness about the benefits of insurance is still quite low. So in India, still people are not that much aware of insurance benefits. The regulator has proposed a women-led Gram Sabha level initiative to educate every household's female head about how such a scheme could come in handy at times of distress. It is also a very nice initiative. Now, IRDA wants that before starting this policy, so they have to they there should be a women led gram sabha left okay women led gram sabha means uh, so that they can educate every household female ki ye jo gram sabha mein jo women hongi jo head hongi okay they should be given that opportunity they should be able to uh, educate every household female head that how this scheme, especially insurance scheme, it is going to be useful in times of distress. Okay, jab bhi koi problem hogi, musibat hogi, problem hogi, so this insurance will be very helpful for them. Okay, so because unless we educate the people, in India people are still very, uh, like very few people are aware about this insurance schemes and all. So first, if they educate the people and if they launch the policy, definitely it is going to be a successful, okay. It is going to be a success. Next. A new Bhima Sugam platform. So might be that new policy can, uh, it can have the term Bhima Sugam platform would integrate insurance players and distributors to give customers a one-stop shop experience to begin with. Okay. So now, uh, this Bima Sugam platform, it would integrate, matlab, isme insurance players bhi aenge, distributors bhi aenge. and it is will be their duty that they are going to give customers a one-stop shop experience. Just a one-stop shop, samajhte hai na? Ki ek jagah kya hai, sab kuch mil gaya. Just a hypermarket saath ki date mein hoga hai. Ki ek shop mein enter kar gaya, apko sab kuch mil jata hai. So in the same way, one Bima and it will serve all the purposes. So us tarah ka kuch plan hai IRDA ka, okay? And facilitate claim servicing going forward, okay? and whatever claims are there so that should be facilitated that should be encouraged linking states digital death registries to the platform the regulator believes could enable life insurance claim to be settled within hours or a day at the most this is the most laudatory part okay now 
they want to link every state's digital death registries okay so it will be linked with the platform okay so that the claim should be settled within hours okay ek ghante bhi na lage aur maximum 24 hours mein jo bhi claims hai wo settle ho jaye okay because when people will get such fast settlement of course they will be uh, inclined to insure themselves okay tabhi wo log apne aap ko insure karenge use of being in a sentence it can be uh, being can be non finite verb it can be main verb also in continuous tense passive voice we use being being ka matlab hona bhi hota hai being a good being human so there are so many usages deepak okay uh, i will uh, see that where you are talking about which statement so i will uh, see that okay now a legislative reboot is also on the anvil it means it is also on the process it is in the way to ease capital requirement norms and allow a slew of slew of means number of series of new players to enter the market and serve the untapped needs of niche and specialized segment okay now a legislative reboot complete reboot is also in the progress okay to ease capital requirement taki capital requirement ko aur zyada easy kiya ja sake and they are also allowing a slew of new players jaise abhi aap dekhenge there are very few insurance companies in india okay so now this market is going to be open for new players also because unless we have multiple companies we are not going to uh, insure every people okay so that is why new players are also allowed to enter the market and serve the untapped needs of the niche okay to jo bhi demand hai jo bhi inki zarurat hai un sare demands ko pura karne ke liye new players ko bhi invite kiya ja raha hai okay and specialized segments okay over two decades after the entry of private players into the once moribund public sector led industry so once this insurance was only public sector industry and when it was public sector industry it was declining so it was declining it was dying and when this insurance sector was dying at that time the entry of private players that uh, so the india's insurance penetration has risen okay so with the arrival of with the entry of private players the uh, insurance penetration has risen at least wo badh gaya hai okay from 2.7% in 2000 went to 2002 to 4.2% in 21 to 22 okay so in 2001 to 2002 it was 2.7% but in 21 22 it is 4.2% okay uh, checking that uh, this sonali In fact there has been a slight slight means decline in the metric over the past decade from 5.2% in 2009 and 10 but still if you compare from 2009 till 2010 so there is a slide in the data because in 2009 to 2010 the rise was 5.2% but fir wo 5.2 se kam ho kar ke kitna ho gaya 4.2% okay you can see with the non life policies yet to surpass the 1% mark and basically whatever insurance we are having so basically we are having life insurance now if we talk about non life insurance okay so they are not even 1% so utn 1% log bhi non uh, non life insurance nahi karwate hain okay given the sheer size sheer size means big size of india's population and poor financial lit uh, financial literacy levels the imperative imperative means urgency to break from the status quo is unquestionable okay now we have such a large population and only 4.2% people are insured so of course this number is very 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 less okay so this is only because of our large population and may, maximum population they are not aware of the uh, this financial literacy okay they are they do not have this financial literacy so because of all these things it is very important that whatever current status quo we are having so we have to break that status quo we have to come out of that okay allow kaha and allow okay so legislative reboot is also on the evil to ease ye aapka isse related hai infinitive to ease capital and allow 2 plus v1 and v1 ab dekhiye ye editor kabhi 2 plus v1 use karta hai aur v1 kabhi yahan pe 2 laga deta hai so editors unke upar itni chhoot hai ki wo jab marzi chahe ye kar sakte hain maximum times mein what do we see 2 plus v1 and 2 plus v1 generally editors use okay और वो ये क्या करते हैं टू प्लस वी वन एंड वी वन बट फॉर अस दिस इज करेक्ट एंड दिस इज रॉन्ग ये ग्रामेटिकली इनकरेक्ट होता हमारे लिए ठीक है एनविल ही तो बोला ऑन दी एनविल 
चलिए नेक्स्ट The IRDA is moved to rope in state governments. Now IRDA is trying to persuade state government, okay, and set up bodies similar to state level backing committees. So now IRDA wants to set up a committees just like backing committees, okay, would help formulate. So this move of RDAs would help formulate granular district wise strategies for raising awareness and coverage levels. Okay. Other IRDA state level pe kaam karega because center level pe it is not possible to cover everyone. But yes, when we start forming committees at the state level, it will be uh, uh, like uh, it will be able to formulate granular district wide strategies. So wo har district according strategies form kar sakte hai and they can raise awareness okay and coverage levels okay. So uh, nation uh, sorry center wise it will not work only state wise will work okay. Industry players also need to look beyond the top cities and Bima Vistar schemes could catalyze the volumes uh, they need to get out of comfort zones okay. Now when we talk about industry players whether it is LIC or whatever insurance companies we have okay they should look beyond the top cities. It is not necessary that we should have Bima uh, this uh, uh, companies only in the cities we have to cover the rural areas also okay then and the bima vistar scheme could catalyze the volume now if they focus on this bima vistar that is to include everyone okay it could definitely catalyze it expedite the volumes they need to get okay so joby volume if they want to ensure many people so definitely they could get all those volumes if they get out of their comfort zones if they establish if they start visiting rural areas and also definitely they can get the volumes in insurance also okay most of all, the center needs to rethink that 18% GST levy on health and life insurance premium. Now, center has levied 18% GST even on health and life insurance. Okay. The notion, notion means idea that those who can afford to buy health cover can afford to pay so much tax is untenable. Now, what the government is saying that if a person is able to buy a health insurance, okay, so that person can definitely pay 18% GST. Because if they afford this, they can also afford to pay 18% GST. They can health insurance, they can pay 18% GST. Okay, so this argument is completely untenable. It cannot be defended. In a country where one health calamity can push a household below the poverty line. Because India is such a nation, if in a family there is a health calamity, so of course that family from middle class, it can move towards the <coughs> APL. <coughs> that is below poverty line. So, levying 18% GST on uh, health insurance, that is completely irrational, illogical. Okay. Ensuring continuity of leadership at IRDAI is equally critical. Okay, so now who is going to be the leader of IRDA? So that is also very important. Situations such as nine month vacuum, there is a nine month gap at its hem before the current chairperson's tenure are simply unacceptable. Okay, so this current chairman he has only nine months left to serve as chairperson okay so this is also very important because it may be possible if some new chairperson come uh, he might not be that much enthusiastic to carry out this scheme okay so that is why who is going to be the leaders okay so this continuity of leadership is also important if we want to uh, have this bima vista okay in effect in practical Chale, guys quickly find the error Quickly let me know what is wrong here, guys. This is what you have to overcome, Apoor. Without reading the sentence, you give the answer. Why large, guys? Aren't we getting the sense of hidden comparison? Aren't we getting the sense of hidden comparison? Last week, the chief, see last week means definite past time is given. So definite past time is given, so it will be regulated unveiled. V2 form is given, that is correct. 
So Chief of India's Insurance Sector Regulator, he unveiled a fresh blueprint to cover a larger portion of the population. Larger means comparatively. कि जितना पहले थे उसके कंपैरिजन में अभी जो पॉपुलेशन है दे वांट टू कवर लार्जर पोर्शन ऑफ द पॉपुलेशन सो हियर वी आर गेटिंग द सेंस ऑफ हिडन कंपैरिजन इट इज एब्सोल्युटली करेक्ट सो देयर इज नो एरर इन दिस अगेंस्ट रिस्क ऑफ एडवर्स शॉक्स विथ एन आई ऑन इंश्योरिंग और इंश्योरिंग एवरीवन आई होप यू नो द डिफरेंस बिटवीन इंश्योर एंड इंश्योर This insurance is insurance is related. तो IRDA आपको क्या कर रहा है एंड इंश्योर बेसिकली वी से मेक श्योर राइट सो सच क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो यू गेट इन योर एग्जामिनेशन सो वी आर नॉट गेटिंग वी आर नॉट टॉकिंग अबाउट मेकिंग श्योर एवरी वन बाई ट्वेंटी फोर्टी सेवन सो इट इज नॉट द कॉन्टेक्ट ऑफ मेकिंग श्योर इट इज द कॉन्टेक्ट ऑफ इंश्योरिंग एवरी वन तो सबको जीवन बीमा निगम चाहिए दैट इज देंस वी आर गेटिंग सो द एर इज इन डी पार्ट इंस्टेड ऑफ इंश्योरिंग इट विल बी इंश्योरिंग इंश्योरेंस रिलेटेड गॉट इट गाइज क्लियर so if there a good question based on ensure and so so you should practice all these types of error it is not only error related to verb and adjective that you have to find out okay chaliye let us discuss the tone of the article what is the tone of first article yes so if we talk about the tone so it is analytical you can say technical also because data was presented okay so analytical technical you can say laudatory also so it is a nice move laudatory optimistic also you can say definitely optimistic laudatory technical and the last line that is is concern because of the chair person who is going to be the next chair person that is very important okay that is a bit concern otherwise it is analytical or technical because data is given laudatory and optimistic okay so this is the tone yes let's see the next article do we need to discuss this article the old and the new on the 2023 ipl final and the cs given so let explain me what do you mean by this title the old and the new what does it refer to quickly anyone who can give who can uh, tell me that what uh, these words the old and the new are referring to innocent stop laughing and quickly tell me Yes, as you know, Gujarat is the new team. Gujarat, ये last year ही बनी है ना last year ही IPL में आई है. So old is Gujarat or new is Gujarat. So CSK new means Gujarat and old means CSK. CSK is an old team of IPL and Gujarat is a new team of IPL. Okay, so that is the sense. Yes. So it is basically the finale was between old and the new. Okay. हाँ समझ गए. So CSK's win over Titans. Titans means Gujarat Titans showcased the best and the latest of the IPL. Okay, so ये जो win था that is मतलब एक होता ना एक बहुत ही mundane game होता है. People are not that much interested. Okay, but this game was really the best game. Okay, and it is the latest of the IPL. Okay, now the weather may have been fickle. ये जो बारिश पूरे जो है IPL परेशान किए ना. So the weather may have been fickle means capricious, कभी धूप, कभी बारिश. Okay, so weather अच्छा नहीं था. Capricious. See the line. Very beautiful line. Okay. With a summer night yielding rain. So weather was not fixed. Okay. Because it was a summer night. There was no. It is not a season of rain. But throughout April, how many times the rain fell? Okay. So now. So with a summer night yielding rain. So during summer night we were having rain. But so the weather was not constant. Here, here capricious. Here, here simple. You can say inconstant. The weather was inconstant. Weather एक जैसा नहीं था, ठीक है? Only see the beauty, okay, of the lines, words, how author has chosen the words, okay, that is important, okay. But there was no mistaking the inevitable air around CSK lifting the IPL trophy on a Monday night that is spilled over to Tuesday. Now listen to me, ठीक है? So weather was not constant, okay, but there was no mistake in the mistaking the inevitable air around means everybody was sure 
ये पहले से ही लोगों को श्योर था दे वर हैविंग श्योरिटी दैट सी एस के इज गोइंग टू लिफ्ट द आई पी एल ट्रॉफी ओके सो देर वॉज नो मिस्टेकिंग इन दिस इसमें किसी को कोई डाउट था ही नहीं जरा सा भी शक नहीं था एवरीबडी वॉज वेरी मच श्योर दैट सी एस के इज गोइंग टू लिफ्ट द टॉप ट्रॉफी ऑन अ मंडे नाइट ओके If that spilled over to Tuesday means it continued till Tuesday because वो late night आपकी तीन बजे तक match चली थी so Monday night से match start हुआ था but because of rain and other things it is spilled over to Tuesday got it guys so it was inevitable it was sure and certain at Ahmedabad Narendra Modi Stadium CSK pulled off pulled off means achieved a last over heist heist here means you can say stealing money okay sorry stealing and all that is run against defending champion gujarat titans with ravindra jareja thumping the winning runs in a in the final that was spread over 3 days so this final continued till 3 days okay guys because yahan pe aapko pata hai <clears throat> uh final uh, that was spread over 3 days because uh, sunday was the scheduled day for final sunday because of rain final nahi hua so it went on monday or monday fir barish ki wajah se late night wo is uh, ho gaya early morning tuesday tak ho gaya okay so that is why this final match of the ipl it went for 3 days right ha uh, sunday monday tuesday ओके एंड बिकॉज ऑफ दिस रविन जरेजा थम्पिंग द विनिंग रन ओके इनकी वजह से ही सीएसके गॉट द विक्ट्री ओके संडे वॉज अ वॉश आउट वॉश आउट मीन्स रेन संडे कोई मैच नहीं हुआ बिकॉज ऑफ रेन एंड ऑन मंडे द रेन इंटरवेंट और मंडे को फिर से बारिश आ गई एंड डिलेड द क्लाइमेक्स दैट इज फनाले इन टू द अर्ली आवर्स ऑफ ट्यूजडे तो वो ट्यूजडे तक चला What is to regal? Regal means honourable, मतलब impressive, majestic, grand. Okay, was CSK's composer. इस पूरे tournament में जो सबसे अच्छा कोई चीज था, so that was CSK's composer. Composer means calmness, calmness. Okay. So what is to honourable was CSK's calmness. A trait imbibed from its eternal skipper. My God, eternal skipper, eternal. You know, forever, everlasting skipper. author himself is a dhoni fan i got to know ms dhoni who also hinted that he may have one more ipl stint okay so in the whole tournament the uh, csk's composer was very very royal okay it was very dignified okay and this is the trait that the entire team they got this trait they absorbed this trait from the eternal ओके स्कीपर एम एस धोनी बिकॉज एम एस धोनी इज मिस्टर कूल ही इज नोन फॉर हिस कामनेस तो जो उनके अंदर की क्वालिटी है वो उनके टीम में भी आ गई है ओके एंड मिस सॉरी एम एस धोनी ऑल्सो हिंटेड दैट ही मे हैव वन मोर आईपीएल स्टेंट तो वो एक और गेम खेल सकते हैं ओके इट वॉज एप्ट दैट CSK the more consistent unit in IPL history took on the Titans ye bilkul sahi hai apt means it is just that CSK and CSK is the most consistent unit in IPL history ki pure IPL history mein sabse consistent agar koi team hai to that is CSK okay the most promising among younger teams and the summit clash had all the thrills associated with t20 cricket okay so agar younger teams mein dekha jaye to gujarat titan is the most promising team okay so that is why this finale clash summit clash means the finale clash it had all the thrills matlab it was a very good match but the people they were on their toes theek hai so it had all the thrills associated with t20 cricket it was not an ordinary game it was a fantastic match because gujarat titans also so they played well okay now csk priced out shubham gill for 39 priced out means i think run over वगैरह कर लिए होंगे यहां पे ठीक है शुभम गिल फॉर 39 39 में CSK ने शुभम गिल को रोक दिया विद धोनीज लाइटिंग लाइटनिंग स्टंपिंग डिलीवरिंग द फैटल ब्लो अब ये सब आप ही बता सकते हैं जिसने मैच देखा होगा कि शायद धोनी ने उनको कॉल आउट कर दिया होगा स्टंप कर दिया होगा राइट right? हाँ तो धोनी स्टम्प्ड सो बिकॉज ऑफ दैट शुभम गिल वॉज रेस्ट्रिक्टेड एट थर्टी नाइन शुभम गिल इज अ प्लेयर ऑफ गुजरात टाइटन्स जल्दी से मेरे को बताइए यस और नो इज ए प्लेयर ऑफ गुजरात टाइटन देखिए मेरे को बहुत कम आइडिया है ठीक है ओके तो नाउ बिकॉज ऑफ दैट हाँ तो शुभम गिल ही वॉज रन आउट बाई धोनी लाइटनिंग लाइटनिंग मीन्स वेरी फास्ट स्टम्पिंग 
so with very fast steep kick uh, uh, speed he did that okay now but one sai sudarshan hammered a 96 so he is also a player of gujarat titans okay so he hammered a 96 uh, runs okay the player hail from chennai so sai sudarshan is from chennai he is not from csk team he is from gujarat titans but he belongs to chennai the titans finished with 214 for 4 okay to un logo ne 214 runs banaya tha Sara also present there. Who is Sara? The target was revised to 171, uh, 171 following a rain break, but CSK proved equal to the task. So the chase was 214 runs, but because of rain interruption and all these things, so the revised target for CSK was of 171 runs. Following a rain break, because of that rain, but CSK proved equal to the task. But Joby task there gave the uh, CSK chase that task. So, Sara Ali Khan ka kya kam tha? Oh, oh. Well, you people are na. I don't uh, know about their relationship, Sara Ali Khan and all. Okay. So, the target was revised to 171 following a rain break, but CSK proved equal to the task. So, unke task unhone equal kar diye the. Okay. Even though Dhoni fell for a duck. Now, tell me. So duck here means zero, out on zero. So did Dhoni got out on zero run? Dhoni ne koi run nahi banaya tha? Might be. Theek hai, baaki log confirm kar sakte hain. So at Jadeja's long handle did the trick. Okay? Ha. So out. So he fell for a duck ki zero run pe hi out ho gaye the. So but still that team win uh, managed to win the match because of Jade, uh, Jadeja's. Okay? Chale next. See, I didn't watch the IPL, but I got to know the entire IPL. मुझे पता चल गया क्या क्या हुआ था, ठीक है? It also marked the culmination of a long drawn tournament with ten squads. So because of this win, CSK's win, so it is what it is the final of the long drawn tournament with ten squads. There were ten teams in IPL, my God. That CSK and Mumbai Indians from the old guard. So CSK and Mumbai Indians, they are two better teams of old. ठीक है? ये पुरानी अच्छी teams हैं. Okay, and Titans and Lucknow Super Giants. So Lucknow Super Giants are two good teams of last year. मतलब they made their debut last year only. You know, ने last year ही debut किया हुआ है. But at least Titans and Lucknow Super Giants, अच्छा they also played well. Good, made it to the last four. Okay, उन्होंने at least last four तक किया. Was a reflection of their innate strength. Okay, कि even though they are new teams, but still they managed to be the last four. So it shows their innate strength. Okay. Mumbai Indians had a slow campaign to begin with, okay? So Mumbai Indians, it started with a very slow run rate and all before finding a second win, before reviving their energy. So initially they didn't perform well, but later they gained, they gained the momentum, okay? Now, while CSK was always in the frame for a playoffs, but so CSK was always in the frame whenever there is a game of playoff, okay? Among the rest, so it was all about Mumbai Indians, CSK, Lucknow Super Giants, and Titans. Okay. Ro among the rest, Royal Challengers Bangalore again faltered. Okay, they again lost their momentum. They couldn't perform well. Well, leaving star batter Virat Kohli. Acha. So Royal Challengers ke batter kaun hai Virat Kohli? Yarning, yarning means desiring. So his desire for an elusive IPL title. So this IPL title is very far from them. It is very difficult for them to achieve that. Okay. So Virat Kohli, he couldn't fulfill his desire. Okay. Because they've lost the match. If Gil, 890 runs, proved that he will be the successor to Kohli and Rohit Sharma. So, Shubham Gil, I think he made 890 runs. Take care. So, it proved that he will be the successor to Kohli and uh, Rohit Sharma in the white ball cricket. Veterans like Ajinkya Rahane, uh, Vritaman Saha and Mohit Sharma also proved adept in 220 format. So, we are talking about different players that all these players performed well. Take care. These players have performed well. Next. Hardik Pandya led Titans well. So Hardik Pandya, the captain of Gujarat Titans, he led the team well and with a bit of luck may have detained the Titans. Thoda sa luck agar favor karta, to shayad Gujarat Titans is bar winner ho jati. Okay? That uh, Sinhali spacer Matisha Pathirana found incredible support within CSK dugout 
एंड द फैंस एट लार्ज इज अ टेस्टिमनी टू स्पोर्ट्स एबिलिटी टू हील्ड ओल फिजर्स अब इनके साथ क्या हुआ था सो सिन्हली स्पेसर मथीसा पथिराना ओके ही फाउंड इन क्रेडिबल सपोर्ट इन दीएसके टीम ओके and the fans they are testimony they are witness to sports ability to hold to heal old fissures shayad inke sath koi pehle kuch disagreement wagaira hua hoga fight hua hoga but now he is a part of team and he got support from the team okay next at the same time the absence of pakistani cricketers also reflects the influence of politics on sport so there were no pakistani cricketers so it also reflects the influence of politics on sport ki sport mein bhi politics aa hi jati hai okay the dust may have settled ki matlab ye sari cheeze with the ipl winning and everything so this complete uh, uh, you can say buzz about the ipl that match, uh, that uh, has been settled that might have been settled on the ipl but there is no respite despite means rest wo naam se lag raha hai ki is from sri lanka for the indian stars as they prepare for the world test championship because ab ye log kiske liye taiyar ho rahe hain wtc ke liye against australia at london oval from june 7th so from june 7th so wtc champion is going to start so there is no rest for indian cricketers inke liye koi cricketer inke liye kuch nahi hai okay got it guys so now we are happy satisfied that we did one article on uh, ipl okay so i hope the entire article is understood omkar ji maine bhi yahi bola hai ki csk ne ipl jeeta pura to article yahi likha csk ne jeeta to kisne bol diya virat ne jeeta virat ka desire desire hi reh gaya okay now find the tone of the article ha ah, very good article isse good article to kuch ho hi nahi sakta tha एनालिटिकल यस बिकॉज पूरा आईपीएल आपको पता चल गया एक आर्टिकल में लॉटेट्री फॉर सी एस के मुझे तो लगता ऑथर है जो हिमसल इज अ धोनी फैन ओके ओके सो एनालिटिकल लॉटेट्री दीज आर द टू थिंग्स ओके यस राइट 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 सो दैट्स इट गाइज ओके use these two phrases in a sentence of your own because the rest all are concerned why concerned because of that politics because of that politics or you can say ha huh, because our players they didn't have that please confirm virat is an actor or cricketer anand what is this question is it a satire on virat kohli so uh, use these two sentences uh, uh, phrases uh, in a sentence of your ha you can say a bit theek hai he is a big fan of dhoni he is a very big fan of dhoni and he himself is a very good cricketer so use this code saba okay for purchasing anything on alibot platform join this telegram channel for updates and for pdf okay thank you guys ending this session okay do hit the like button subscribe to our yt channel share this session with others okay thank you guys thank you for watching okay ending this session acha you all are dhoni's fan matlab mujhe to lagta hai ki why other cricketers are even playing when everybody is behind dhoni only Virat is also a good player. 